British officials say they've fixed a technical failure at a key air traffic control facility, but not before the glitch snarled flights in London and across the southern United Kingdom. The airspace is one of the world's busiest. Following a technical failure at Swanwick, the system has been restored, British air traffic control provider Nats said in a statement just before noon ET, about 5 p.m. London time. However, it will take time for operations across the UK to fully recover so passengers should contact their airline for the status of their flight. Nats says British airspace was never closed but that air traffic control was restricting traffic volumes in accordance with capability we currently have in our system following the outage. Some inbound flights still landed at London area airports during the outage, but most departures were halted. Many other incoming flights that were scheduled to land in the southern United Kingdom diverted to other airports. Just at London Heathrow. Flight tracking service flight to air counted 60 cancellations and more than 336 delayed flights, as of 12.25 p.m. ET. That means more than a quarter of all of Heathrow's Friday flights have been delayed or cancelled, and it was likely those numbers would grow as the cascading effects of the outage affect more flights. Flights at a number of other UK airports also showed disruptions. By airline. Ryanair had grounded nearly 100 flights across its European network while British Airways had scrapped nearly five dozen. Perhaps worse for BA was that nearly two out of every five of its flights on Friday showed as delayed, according to FlightAware. Ryanair is headquartered in Ireland, but has a large presence at several airports in London and in England. British Airways, the top carrier in both the United Kingdom and at London's Heathrow Airport, warned customers about possible problems. We are working hard to look after our customers who have been affected by the air traffic control failure experienced by all airlines at Heathrow, Gatwick and London City Airports, British Airways says in a statement. We anticipate disruption to both departing and arriving aircraft but will do all we can to minimize any impact. BA said it would waive change fees for customers scheduled to fly through London today.